Hi everyone, and welcome back, finally to, wait for it, wait for it, there it is, Strong Bad's Cool Game for Attractive People, Episode 5, the middle of it, um, it's been a while, because it's been crazy, but we're back, finally, um, our goal is to stop Trogdor from rampaging, and we are currently inside of his video game cabinet in the game Peasant's Quest. Uh, because we finally got in here. We had to, like, recruit Marshy, who was a red jello marshmallow, and use him to as 3D glasses or decoder glasses or something crazy like that. Uh, so yeah, we're in here. We just picked up the dots that we can give to the poop smith but we haven't talked to anybody else in here i think we checked under the, the box we did okay let's talk to rather dashing hey it's rather dashing star of peasant's quest looking blocky and pixely as ever rav say i always wanted to ask what's up with the short pants, short pants. these things are incredibly comfortable I'd like to see you get rock or throw baby while wearing long pants. Fair enough. Hey, <laughs> I need your help. He sounds like every fable NPC. Hey, why don't you come with me to kill Trogdor? I could use someone as kindling. I mean, a distraction, distraction. while I slay the beast. Sorry, but I'm no longer in the dragon slaying business. What? Getting burninated over and over again is not a very rewarding career path. And it hurts. I wish I could just Real extend bad. my torso. So a I've bit. shifted my focus to princess saving. Yeah? How's that going for you? Honestly, business has been a bit slow. I've yet to meet a single damsel in distress. Well. Where can a peasant brother lay his hands on a trog sword? I got trog doors to smite. Well, normally it's on display at the inn, right here in Peasantry. But recently, a strange burst of energy swept the sword away to a foreign land of floating platforms and slightly higher resolution. Soon Ooh. after, another stranger looking quite a bit like yourself visited Peasantry asking each of us for, for a, a challenge. challenge. Wait, no. Stinko Man? My favorite Japanese cartoon video game version of me? I love that guy! He's pretty cool. He desired a challenge, so I sent him on a quest to retrieve our sword back from whatever strange realm it ended up in. I assume he's still there, for he has not yet returned. Oh man, we gotta go save Stinko Man? I need you to help me find some kind of special sword and kill Trogdor, so I can keep Homestar from popping up on my face all the time. Congratulations, you won a free MP3 player. Click here for Lolo Waits. <laughs> Trogdor? I'm not going anywhere near that dragon. Hasn't anyone told you? He's indestructible. Not even the mighty Trog Sword can smite him. Oh, man. That's not what I heard. You must have been doing it wrong. I suppose it's possible that I was simply smiting him in the wrong spot. <laughs> Tales have been told about weak spots in the beast's scaly armor, but I've never seen any. All right. So we need to go to the inn, or rather, we need to find Stinko Man. Can we jump straight here? Because yes, we can. Because I want to, I want to give the Poopsmith his his what's it. Hey, uh, Mister! I think I found some rivets. <laughs> At least I think they're rivets. I guess they could be grapes. Or nickels. Cool! So you'll join my party? That's what I'm talking about! Mr. Fixit. Oh, I was gonna dance to that. Okay, so now that just make sure we have as much as we can before we do the rest of this. Path to in. I feel like there was something else over here running around. Oh, the scorpion monster. The king of town? How'd he end up in peasantry? Roar! Growl! That's no king of town. 
That's the dreaded Munchox the Devourer. It's like everything it's Rotom Dex wants to be. Well, come on. He's not that scary. Not him. You trying to pronounce Devourer. Devourer. I never in a million years thought I'd say this, but that's a pretty cool tale you got there, King of Town. Roar! Growl! Hello. Welcome. You got it. All right. Yes, I know, but. Oh. What did you expect the giant Squirby monster to do? Good thing you I dead. always ignore the text in these games. Otherwise, that box might discourage me. <laughs> it sure does blend in the grass. You got green today. Um. Hey, we don't have the uh, the metal detector. Okay. So let's check the inn then. So there is something beyond the King of Town, but we need something to stop him. Carriage repair. Oh. Uh, hey, uh, Ron Vees. Thank you for the follow. Also, shout out to um, Obono Piam. Piamo? I don't know. Something. Somebody followed while I was off stream. So. Uh, I want to thank them for that too. Hey, welcome, welcome. Happy to have you. It's a good graphic Katir collector's oh, card. Geez. Antisocial oh. Angus. <laughs> I guess that's funny. Almost. 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 Maybe. So this no, is a telltale game off the Homestar Runner universe. This is Strong Bad's cool game for attractive people. Uh, this is episode five, so if you've ever played like a tail, uh, a Telltale game, it's like a point-and-click adventure game. Um, they've done like Walking Dead and uh, Borderlands. They've done a bunch of uh, Batman, and they've done some original stuff. But uh, I kind of grew up in the the early age of the internet, the early aughts on this website, and finally got around to playing this game and. Uh, I'm super enjoying it. <laughs> I can't get ye flask. You just have to sit there and wonder why on earth you can't get ye flask. Ye oldy crate? There aren't supposed to be crates in peasantry. Must be a memory leak or something. Uh, it did come out. It came out originally on the Wii, so that's the right the right timeline thereabouts i'm not sure when it, when exactly it was released let's see look it up hi like. decrepit old person oh youngster what can i do for you oh and like all of the voices except the one female character are done by one dude so that's also kind of uh impressive let's see if i could spell on my phone here it's a cool game for attractive people was released oh no dates come on oh yeah between august 11th and december 15th so yep yep these games always have some kind of weapon you need to the first the episode dragon. came out on the 11th have you seen anything like that old man i used to have the legendary trog sword on display to honor the many lives of rather dashing lost <laughs> to trogdor but it was swept away during the recent rumblings in the sky well, thanks for uh, stopping by. We'll uh, watch the watch the language, but appreciate it. I don't Hi, know, decrepit off. old person. Hello, youngster. What can I do for you? I've lost my cursor. No, I keep Hi, clicking off this guy. Old... Hello, young. Sir, you seen a dragon around here? Big, big. Oh, hang on, one second. Uh, I was just trying to. Yarm. Scales and teeth that look like consummate bees. You mean Trogdor? I haven't seen the beast since the mysterious rumblings in the sky roused the dragon from his lair. That's cool. Rumblings I'll in find the sky. him and hack him to bitch somewhere else then. I'm afraid that's not possible. Trogdor's only vulnerable when he's in his lair. Your best bet is to wait there for him to return. But alas, the lair is being guarded by an evil princess. You don't hear too much about evil princesses, do you? It's all evil queens, wicked stepmothers, <laughs> and hot witches, mostly. 
He's not wrong. This place is awesome! If I ever open up a bed, breakfast, and biker bar, it'll look just like this one. Uh, I wouldn't recommend it. The inn itself doth make little money. That's why I had to open a carriage tow and repair service as well. Tow and Should repair. Should you need a carriage repaired, just come see me. Oh, we do need a carriage repair. That's correct. What's with that ye flask over there? You probably wish you could get that. It's true. Well, I yeah, I do now. What do you need ye flask for anyway? I don't know. Isn't that what you're supposed to do? Just pick up all the crap that's lying around hoping it'll be useful for some stupid thing later? It's true. Uh, you can't get ye flask. Okay, fine. I'm just saying. Don't leave ye flask just lying around in plain view if you don't want people trying to pick them up. Not cool. There's good points all around. Hey, I got a job for you. Huzzah. So where is this carriage? Uh, it's pretty far away from here. As far as the peasantry woods? You better just come with me. <laughs> Alright, easy enough. Just take him away from everything he's ever known. Can we go inside? I think that inn might get more business if it had a <laughs> functioning door. Nothing worth seeing in there anyway. Touch. Peasants. You shall not pass. Hey, I'm trying to find... Excuse me, I... Hey, you! Trogdor Slayer looking for help! They're all just on fire. And then there's Strong Sad. Hark! Who goes there? Leave this place now, lest I, the evil wizard Slushfund, be forced to cast an evil spell on you. Uh, I think they mixed up your order at the costume palace, prom queen. They must have made a mistake. It's fate. I was sitting in my room alone. As always. <laughs> when a blinding flash of light knocked me off my feet, I woke up here in the land of peasantry, obviously dressed as a powerful evil wizard. Evil spell, evil spell. Step aside, little, uh, sister. <laughs> Strongbad's got a trog door to smite. No way. What? <laughs> I am evil wizard Slushfund, bouncer of Trogdor's lair. And you're oh, not man. on ye guest list. I want to be on ye guest list. So, who exactly do you think you are? As I told you, puny knight, I am the evil wizard, Slushfund. Yes, of course. Evil <laughs> wizard. What? Uh, hate to break it to you, slosh fiend, but you're clearly a princess. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm an evil wizard. Just look at my wizard hat. Oh, your evil wizard hat? You mean the one that is pink <laughs> and sparkly? Not that there's anything wrong I don't with care that. what you say. I'm an evil wizard. It's my job to guard this lair and give out quests. All right, give us a quest. Okay, princess quest giver. Hit me with your best quest. Very well. You must venture deep into the forbidden forest and retrieve thy amulet of ancient summoning That's from the cute. ravenous munchox. And what do I get in return? First, bring me the item. Then we'll talk about your reward. Now, I'm pretty sure most quest givers are upfront about what the reward's going to be. Um, but we don't currently have a way to get past the king of town. So I guess let's go repair the spaceship. Now I gotta find a place for the peasantry inn on my map. Right there. Scribble, scribble. Perfect pixels. Fantastic. I wanted to talk to me. Alright, let's see. Inventory. What am I supposed to do with this? This isn't like any carriage I've ever seen. Oh, come on! It's a space carriage! That's the best kind of carriage! I love the whale so much. Ah, what do I know? I'm just a simple peasant. <laughs> Hit it with your hand. Pyrotechnics! Well, alright! Just point us at the Babelians and let us do our <laughs> thing! 
Uh, what type of aliens you guys looking for, anyway? Hey, man, limousine don't discriminate. You can't There'll just leave your peasants around. There'll be a lady who wants to party. All right. Can we, uh, can we have them beam up Marzipan? She's, like, throwing crates is a type of partying, right? Let's see. Fly, my hair metal rockers! Be free! <laughs> Moderately hot baby in off the port bow! <laughs> Crazy chick from the Battle of the Bands! Ow! <laughs> hey, continuity. Crazy, pretty mama! Wow! Thought she'd never leave! Alright, so what does that get us? There you go, strong bam! Just stick that back in the machine and you can play whatever game you want! Even those crazy foreign type games! Ah, uh, let's just go Yata. to 20XD6. Oh, star! Yatta! I thought once you fixed that thing, I'd be rid of him for good! Ain't gonna be that easy! As long as Trump draws out running around burning everything up, the machine can't be fixed. You're gonna have to take him out old school style. We're talking medieval old school. Hey, yeah. Uh, you ask you me. Just to remind you. Now I'm gonna see if I can hitch a ride on that Babley and Space Bus. Wait up, guys! Alright. Making progress. We need to go back to the mainframe. So now, we can go here. Now I want to be the guy too! <laughs> Step aside, come on! Oops. Hey, brought you! Whoa! I just got an extra life! I must be even more bodanical than I thought! What the? What am I doing down here? I'm supposed to be up there where all the runny, jumpy, shooty action is! Hey, be quiet down there! I'm right in the middle of I the I want to be the guy too! Yes, I know. Hey, bad guy! But, Check out these moves. I think this yeah, came yeah, out yeah, first. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like the... Oh, jeez. The, uh... Stinko Man episode of Strong Bad came out before I Want to Be the Guy, the game. Because I Want to Be the Guy was high school and Stinko Man's middle school. I hope you guys don't mind a long wait. When I get up there, I'm taking it all the way to level 50. Level 50 with your giant head and tiny mouth? <laughs> no way! We won't be waiting long! Stinko man still at full energy! That's right! I ate an energy bar for breakfast that gave me the energy bars I need for the rest of the day! Hey. Okay. Walk all the way over there. It's still only in level 1-1! One, one. Man, if I were in charge, I'd be all the way to level 10.5, fighting the secret hidden boss, Stickly Man. Yeah, but I gotta, I gotta imagine that Japanese cartoon Strong Bad Email came out before that. Broken ladders. Stinko Man. That shockwave must have hit the video games harder than I thought. Everything's broken. Broken platform. This place is a dump. How am I supposed to get across to get the trunk sword when everything around here is broken? Hmm, do we have? Oh, we do. Here you go, Mr. Fixit. Work your magic. Rivets. Nice work. Hey, how much would you charge to build a 200 foot wall around Marzipan's house? Three dollars? That's great. Oh, never mind. <laughs> a lot of money. Okay. So we can have him fix the ladders. Okay, mister! Fix it! I'm surprised he didn't get shot by the, uh... Okay, so we don't need to fix that one. We probably need to fix this one. 
One more time. Dink, 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 dink. All right. Brown tint. Hey, I'm there. What? Who said that? Me, down here. Hey, I gotta tell you something. So, hey, bro, some sweet energy ball shooting you got going on there. So, listen, let's be buds. I just need you to get me that totally gnarly sword over there and... Uh, oh, great, another one. Look, why can't you guys just speak normally? Oh, I would... I'd have a lot more respect for you if you just stop trying so hard to be cool and talk to me like a human <laughs> being. But you're a robot. Oh, now you're gonna judge me. I don't have time for this. Alright. Keep on keeping on, brown fan. About Torch. Hey, Pinchy! Hey, you weren't supposed to talk down there. And don't call me Pinchy. I do have a name, you know. Torch. Forget that. I got something <laughs> important to say. Uh. You see that sword over there? Why don't you just clamp onto it and bring it over here for me? No, sorry, I can't. I'm only supposed to hurt you guys, not help. Well, you're certainly doing a bang-up job of not helping. <laughs> hey, come on, man. That's not fair. I got a job to do here, you know? All right. And I'm done talking. We talk to Stinko. Hey, Stinko man! What do you want? Check out that pinchy guy. That guy looks awesome. I'd hate to get caught in his grip. Ooh, George? <laughs> that guy is so dumb. Ha <laughs> ha, dumb ha! He is a dumb! Well, what about that guy shooting at you? He looks like he could really mess you up, man. Yeah, he wishes on his birthday. George and Brown Tent are level one enemies. They don't offer a significant challenge. Those guys are too slow, too predictable, and too not powerful enough to stop me. We'll see. Hey, how do I get up there? I need that sword. <laughs> no way. <laughs> you couldn't handle that sword. I'm going to get that sword for myself just as soon as I'm finished toying with these guys. Come on, man. That's so not cool. <laughs> One day you'll get your baby turn. Poor babies who have a turn. Every time. Uh, we'll be mean though. Why did I call you Stinko Man? Seems a little harsh. Why did I call you Dumb Face? Um, they don't. Is it because your face is dumb and at the same time you have a dumb face? No one calls me that. <laughs> Maybe they should call you dumb butt face because your face and your butt are both dumb. <laughs> Robots. <laughs> <laughs> Stinko man it is. Stinko man it is. All right. I better stop talking to you while I still think you're somewhat cool. Okay, so Can we just go up there. The frog sword is here, but I'll never be able to reach it stuck down here in the UI. Yeah, the extra lives don't do anything. We need to get Stinko Man killed. Huh? Can, will this work on this broken ladder? I guess is the next thing. Keep building until you hit the Cloud Kingdom. They keep all the cool stuff hidden That's away true. above the high score. Hmm? We got Can't buffs. reach it until I find a way to get up into the so, game. Uh... What do you guys do while you're down here waiting to get in the game? I am studying the moves of Stinko Man Sensei to achieve great victory. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Alright. I don't really have. Uh, no. Space Circus Bear? I can't send the performing bear out into the wild for no reason. When he's ready <laughs> to leave. Oh, no. Yeah, I can't shoot him. Boxer Joe? Doesn't Boxer Joe only fight snakes? Can we release the snakes? I better not use my snakes here. They could slither away. Okay. Uh, Marshy? That won't do anything interesting. Hmm. The Algebra? The Algebras are only good at math. They're not really...
This game is too slow, Strong Dad. Faster! Faster! Faster, faster. How could how could we turn it up? Let's go back. The only the only speed settings we've seen were in the the fruit border. Looks like my score was so high yeah, it broke the game. Okay. Can we go in there now? Space circus catastrophe? No way am I going in there. Those evil space clowns are bad news, man. Um, let's see. We've been to all those. If we do, we think any of these can stop the king of town. Actually, let's see. This is gonna be faster. It's gonna be a challenge, but there's gotta be room for Stinko Man 20x6 somewhere on here. Alright. Let's try here again. Roar! Roar! Oh, crap. Smack. Good thing I always. Okay. A red square, or blue square. It's on the shop pot. Okay. I can't send the- Nope. Hmm. Wait, what am I looking for here? Can't think of anything else we haven't resolved yet, though, is the problem. See, we have emails to check, I guess. A lone space marine against an unstoppable army of zombie elves on the beaches of Normandy. That's quite His a thing. only weapon, email. Oh, two. Okay. Dear Strongback. I think you have the best taste in video games and are never wrong. You're my new best friend. But my <laughs> brother just got this new game where you can't die at all. You just get stuck. I think this is boring, but what do you think about games where you can't die? John Platts. Ack! A video game where you can't die? No, that doesn't sound boring at all. It sounds... <laughs> what? Oh, sorry. Not at off there. But seriously, what are you supposed to do in a game where you can't die? Pick up things? Be talk Wario. to people? Talk to people about things you just picked up? Let me be first in line not to play that game. Sometimes I try to die in games that don't even let you die. Like Solitaire. I swear, if I keep playing two cards of the same suit on top of each other, that one-eyed jack will jump out and stab the crap out of me. <laughs> All right, delete. Deleted. <laughs> what gives in Peasant's Quest? It says that nobody can be Trogdor, but I thought Stormbad <laughs> could beat anybody. So my question is, who would win in a fight? You are Trogdor, Manny. Manny. Stormbad. Manny emails are better written than this one. Manny people have asked me to use the shift key, but I refuse to listen. <laughs> of course I would win. I birthed Trogdor. It's like how your dad always shellacks you at tennis even when he's 70 years old. He knows My all goodness. your moves. You wouldn't know it to look at him, but that beefy arm has no backhand. And his net game is practically non-existent. <laughs> I could easily take him in straight sets. Oh, wait. You asked about a fight with a dragon that breathes fire. Hmm. Maybe I should come up with some kind of non-tennis related plan to defeat that guy. Now, we gotta get that sword. How are we gonna get that sword? So the only other thing that I can think of that has changed is that we can go to the concession stand without Bubs there. Does this guess anything? Yep, 
The concession stand is still there. It does not. Okay. Picked up our shipment already. Marzi Kong was tossing these things around like she's got an infinite supply of them. I'm getting dizzy just looking at that mountain of power-ups, ammo, medkits, <laughs> extra lives, shields, coins, bananas, and... Oh, maybe a little nauseous. Nauseated, sir. Come on. You know better than that. So we still can't get you flask. Peasants are still on fire. You shall not pass. I know, bud. Hey, Red Square. Er it's on the shop pot. All right, let's go back to Stinko Man then. Got to be something we can do here. Stinko Man still at full energy. That's right. I ate an energy bar. He won't go for it. Snake Boxer may only do Shh. So, uh... I am studying... Yo! Hey! Oh. Did you know that Stinko Man makes fun of you behind your back? Oh, of course I know. I mean, have you listened to the guy for more than ten seconds? He's got the brain power of a first grader at nap time. <laughs> But despite my college education and middle class upbringing, daytime TV has somehow gotten its hooks into me and made me a sucker for gossip. So, what's he saying about me? Turtle. He said you were too slow. What, you mean like moving too slow or shooting too slow? Because if it's moving too slow, well then yeah, I, I agree with him. I basically just sit here and shoot. I guess I could shoot faster, though. I'll give that a shot. No pun intended. Okay. Hey, up there! What? Who said that? Me, down here! Hey, I... Man! Okay, give me the scoop. Alright, uh... He says you're too predictable. Really? Interesting. This for Mr. Run to the right and shoot. Whatever. <laughs> Okay. He said you weren't powerful enough. Uh, are you serious? Last week I hit that guy with one shot, knocked him off a ladder, and left him crying for Stinko Mommy. Make <laughs> that right choice. One shot! I saw it! Nice. Okay, so we got him shooting faster now. Keep on keeping on, brown pant. So now we gotta hey, talk to George. Trinchy. So, I was just talking to that Stinko Man guy, and he told me he thinks you guys are wussies. What? Ooh, when I get a hold of him, he'll wish he was never born. <laughs> what did he say exactly? Uh, we'll go he the said other you way. weren't powerful enough. Oh, yeah? Well, hang on. Let me see if I can increase the power in my pinches. Well? Hang on. Almost. Okay, I think that's got it. Yeah, I can't see any difference. <laughs> okay, yeah, they're the same. They're the same. But he doesn't have to know that. Too predictable? He says you're too predictable. Seriously? Oh man, now I won't <laughs> be able to stop thinking about it. Just going back and forth all the time. Well, maybe if I change up my moves a bit, like this? Take that, pattern recognition! Hey, what is going on here? You guys are ganging up on me! <laughs> too predictable, huh? And too slow? Well, how do you like us now? Hey, you guys are cheating! No fair! Cheers! You made my stomach hurt! Hey, that was pretty good. Did you alter your pattern? I didn't know you could do that. Yeah, well, how about you, huh? I saw that rapid-fire action. Pretty sweet! Thanks. 
Hey, you want to take off early? Get some cold ones? I'm so freaking look. Yeah, you do. Boop. Nice. Yes. All right, let's get that box. Box. I wonder where those boxes come from, anyway. I hope it's not one of those creepy workshops run by elves, gnomes, dwarves, fairies, or midgets. All right, well, midgets is unnecessary. Game from 2008, everyone. It's Stinko Man's spiky Japanese cartoon hair. So blue and luxurious, without using any product. No matter that big has to go somewhere cool. Right? What the? <laughs> The ladder is a lie. Gasp. Another reference. It's a good ladder climb animation. Uh -huh. Is that not By just the, the Thundercat sword? Oh, no. Extended memory management. Raster interrupt six. Hold and modify. And the mighty mode eight. The power of the trunk sword is mine! Yeah, you got the sword. Now you can play the dragon. More importantly, I'll be able to keep you from popping up and interrupting all my future scheduled makeout sessions. Uh, I've got access to your online calendar in here, and I don't see any scheduled makeout <laughs> sessions. Just pedicures and bubble baths. Yeah, that's code for makeout session. Just get out of here. The original Netflix. Quit touching my stuff. The fabled drug sword is mine. Nice. Okay, so I wonder if we can use it on the King of Town. Because we need him to go away. The trog sword won't work on anything but the trog door. <laughs> Interesting, okay. So I think he's running around the... Burninated bush is funny. Alright, I think he's just running around in the background, so... Uh, excuse me. I don't like that. I really hated that. Weird. Okay. Can we just get it out? The trog sword won't work on any. The trog sword. Okay. Have we seen Trogdor somewhere though? Or no, we have to go to his lair. Even though he is clearly rampaging. Hmm. Sir? Okay, right, there he is. Oop. Dang it, come back. I don't think I can click him from there. We'll talk to rather dashing. Let's see. The trogs. Yeah, yeah. Hey, picture. My name and physical appearance are rather dashing. Rather dashing. Hey, I think I found a princess for you. She's right out in front of the path to Trogdor's lair. Oh yes, her. <laughs> She's one I can't exactly sweep off her feet, eh? Uh, fortunately, she doesn't appear to be in any sort of peril. Thank goodness. Come on. Obviously, she needs saving from the all-ye-can-eat buffet. Yikes. I think it may be the other way round, good sir. Touche. Alright. Before, when you were talking, I wasn't paying any attention. <laughs> what did you say happened to the trog sword? The one you call Stinko Man is a tempted world where platforms, Mr. and extra men are extremely hard. Platforms, eh? 
Looks like I'm gonna have to find a way into the Stinko Man Cave and get the trunks on before he does! Already did it. Okay, so we need to put Strong Sad into some distress. So that we can. Oh, can we get it now? Nope. Level four spell of snake summoning. Huzzah! All right. Smash crate. What do you want to smash the crate with? A snake boxer. <laughs> nice. Cool, an all-purpose med kit. With this, I can cure the sick and heal the lame. Maybe even the ultra lame, like Strong Sad. All right, let's try it. <laughs> Might be able to save the peasants. Ye who enter here. On second thought, I don't want to waste a med kit on Strong Sad. I'm just huge bone. <laughs> huge bone. That doesn't need healing. I mean, they will. Did we know anybody who was her? Oh, uh, Coach Z, right? Because now we have uh, the antidote. Let's see. Now let's see if I can really heal the lame. Why did I put in those things? <laughs> that feels great. Tell you what, though, that'll teach me to carry around this bowl of scorpion food in my back pocket. Okay. Hey, strong bed. Great day for a half athlon. Why were you carrying a big ball of scorpion food? <laughs> to seed the track, obviously. Can't have a proper half athlon without a pack of ravenous scorpions now, can you? What did you do to the track, coach? Ain't it grand? I've been trying for years to get the host of Vitelectric's half athlon. And it's finally come true. Uh, do you need another med kit, coach? <laughs> or maybe something to come down off the last one? That bright light in the sky oh, was the scorpion a signal. food for the king of I town. I knew it was my duty to recreate the half athlon, right down to the lava pit and the ice level. Okay. Ah, uh, the obligatory lava. I'll see you. But I. Okay. Let's just not touch the scorpions. Not touch the scorpions. And pick up the food. Scorpion food. Mmm. Ah, those scorpions are really homed in on this stuff. Good thing <laughs> there's an ice level between us. Alrighty. Oh, we can't. Huh. Oh, 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 oh. Ah! No! <laughs> Get off! Man, those scorpions are nasty. I almost got killed out Man, there. If only, huh? Actually, you did. Get out of town. Yup. The big sleep, the dot nap, the brown shimmy. Lucky for you, this video game checkpoint brought you back to life. Sweet! I'm immortal! But what about all my cool stuff? You can't take it with you. You only get to keep the stuff you had at the last checkpoint. Crap! Interesting. So, can we... I guess first let's do this. Hey, strong bird! Great. Can we take the checkpoint with us? Sure wish I had one of those last week when the cheat dared me to drink all that drain cleaner. Hey. Keep on checking my points, checkpoint. Okay. I'll 
Zoop. So how... How are we gonna stop the scorpions? Man, those scorpions look angry! If they only had more pixels, you could see the venom dripping from their tiny pinchers! Can we... blast them? No, it doesn't seem like it. Okay. Can we snake them? I better not use my snakes here. They like, can they slither can get away. Out? There's a wall. It's fine. Hmm. Boxer Joe won't fight scorpions. They got too many legs. So hard to click on them. Ugh. I don't know why it doesn't want to click him. Hey, Red Square! Er, yeah. It's all. That doesn't need healing. Do it after the fixer guy. Can we just go around? Picking up the scorpion food again. Hope I don't get stung. Two thoughts, same time. Alright, nothing else over there. Cause I don't think we get any. Yeah, they just immediately murk you. No, get off! But so you don't have any chance. So you have to do it before. Uh, did I die again? <laughs> yup. You popped up on my interface just to say yup. Yup. Yep. Good jokes. Good jokes. So what are we supposed to do? Yeah, you can't, it doesn't seem like they're clickable. Um, I mean, I really. I don't think Mr. Fix-It can fix it. Fair. Trogsword doesn't work on. I'm trying to think what game the Scorpions are, are, only from, good at... are from that, um, that we could fight. No, the snakes go away, so we know it's not the snakes. Oh, that's a that is a thought. Okay, let's try that. Uh, huh. Not interactable. Okay, comrade, let's see what you can do. Oh, you just throw the checkpoint. Hey, it's round, isn't it? Now get putting. Yeah. Put, shot, shot, put. Nailed it. Zavago! <laughs> we got there. We got... No, come back. Grab the vine. Stop walking. Grab the vine. <laughs> All right. Yeah. I hope this scorpion food appreciates all the stinging and walking into the light I'm going through. <laughs> all right, checkpoint up. Okay, now can you maybe remember what I'm holding? If you want to die right, you gotta do everything yourself. <laughs> if you want to die right. 
Pod shot shot pod. No. Rise and go. <laughs> Just shouting a random numbers. And my numbers uh, are the names. obligatory ice level. Less friction, more, more penguins. penguins. Oh, 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 oh. Get, get him off! Dog bag. Oh, I could swear I was just stung to death by low red scorpions. Oh, you were. But your video game checkpoint brought you back to life. Cool. And hey, I've still got the scorpion food. Yeah, we do. Uh, maybe I should just get out of here. Yeah, maybe. Alright. Rankity rank, rank up. Right. I don't think they'll want that. Do we? Oh, uh, we'll give it to uh, Strong Sad to make him in distress because it looks kind of like the amulet. Hark! Who goes there? Oh, it's you. Shut up. Okay, here's that quest thing you sent me out for. Um, are you sure this is the quest item? Of course, it looks just like the thing you showed me. Hmm, I guess you're right. Behold, the quest item is recovered. Oh, man, this is gonna be good. Ah, help! Strong man, did you give me scorpion food? Ah, maybe. Who remembers anymore? <laughs> nice. All right. Now, rather dashing, we'll save him, maybe. Hey, Pixel Man! My name dashing. Guess what? Your moment of destiny has arrived. The Munchox is attacking the princess. The Munchox. A princess? Oh, right. Her. Uh. Are you sure? Positive, man. Now get your short pants over there and rescue her. Do it. Well, I... That is my duty. I suppose oh, I should be me. off then. To rescue the princess. <laughs> Very well. Take me there. <sighs> <laughs> nice. But first... Was over here. The door. That must be that scorpion monster's cave. I don't want to know what kind of low-res horrors he keeps locked away in there. Can we have this? Aha! I got the, um, whatever this is supposed to be. The quest thing, okay. Weird we can't go in the door, right? Never fear, O oh fair uh, maiden. <laughs> I am here to save you. I'm not a princess. I'm an evil wizard. Without oh, a apostrophe. Really? If you're a wizard, then I don't need to save you. Roar! Roar! No, wait. I'm a dual-class wizard princess. <laughs> See my pretty princess hat? Please well, help me. Well, now you're going to give Craig ideas. Well, if a princess you are, then save you I will. Stand back. Wait, is that scorpion bait you have? Yes, what should I do? Get rid of it, stupid uh, fair maiden! Wow, saved by a real life adventurer. I suppose you want me to be in your party now. Nah, I'm good. Well, actually, I was just going and to- I can be your spellcaster. And we could explore the evil salt marshes and kill How can a orcs salt marsh be evil? and rats. Actually, I was just going to stand around in the forest some more. Nonsense! I can see it now. I can add bard talents and chronicle our adventures. I think this is the beginning of a There's beautiful a friendship. Ouch! Poor guy would have done better against Trogdor. But now we get to go do that. He'll burn us all! There he is! The one with the trog sword! 
Who, me? Join him! <laughs> He'll protect us! No, I won't. No! Hey, get off! Quit that! <laughs> we are peasants. Okay, fine. You guys can come with me. But don't touch any of my stuff! Don't do it. Oh. Well, alright! Oh, he has a castle. Where'd he go? Here, Trondor! Come here, boy! I just got a cool sword I wanted to show you! Crap, he got away. If those screaming peasants were right, his lair's underneath the castle. I'll have to make my way through these seemingly endless hallways to get down to the dungeon and take him out on his home turf. Trogbad, you read me? Jeez. According to my intel, Trogdor is at the end of these seemingly endless hallways. Homestar, what are you doing? Just delivering your mission objectives. I already <laughs> did that just fine without your help. Oh, oh, I see. Well, can you do this? Hey, cut it out! Where'd you <laughs> put my camera? Man up, soldier. Your free country is depending on you. The people, give them the one down. Use the WASD keys or arrow keys to move Strongbad through the hallways. Press the right mouse button to use the current weapon. Press the left mouse button to make him look at objects or use objects from the inventory. Okay. Get splonked. Okay, so we definitely want to equip the sword. Or no, or do we want the... Wolfenstein 3D time. All right, All right we'll... let's do this mono e beefy armo. One of Trogdor's minions! A fiendishly difficult polynomial equation! Is it though? Man, how big is this castle? Um. Go get it, out, Factor bros. this! A secret passage! Nice. This'll get me to Trogdor twice as fast! Since this castle's like a jillion miles long, apparently. Oh, so you're gonna play dirty, Trogdor? Sending one of your space circus catastrophe clowns at me? Well, who can play at that game? Uh, alright, inventory, that's bear. Performing bear, I choose you! Sick him! Be <laughs> free, performing bear! Raised him from a cub. I'm not gonna cry. Another secret passage. Interesting. It's Nebulon, Limousine's second greatest nemesis next to Alternative Rock. <laughs> I really should break this place up with a potted plant or something. We're Quaking still Limousine. The power of metal. Rock on! Another secret why, passage. Why would we not just go through the door that? Okay. Interesting. Are we getting closer? 300 feet? Let's see. 200? Okay, we are getting closer. your Wolfenstein. Finally! I've reached another room that looks just like all the other rooms. Could have at least added a torch or something. <laughs> Trogdor! The fruit of my skills of an artist. And now it comes down to this. Know, the epic the battle. The final confiscation. The last cutscene. Wow. 
walk right through the fire. He did a forward leaping backflip. Well, that was a little anticlimactic. Uh oh. Oh man. Oh way, you came to rescue me. Well, you <laughs> walk me out? How much do you bench? What are you Whoa! I don't believe it! Whoa. They finally listened to me! He's got robot legs. You look pretty whipped. Ah, Mip Map! Check out all these polygons! And this blade! <laughs> I, I'm the best graphics ever made! Uh strong bed. I'm kind of having a moment, Tom Star. Don't interrupt. Oh. Oh my. Oh, we got some chest high walls. Puzzle pillars. Oh, okay. So we got pedestals. Ultimate Trogdor. And we got home stars. Those pedestals are for offerings to the mighty Trogdor. Uh, Mr. Fixit? I don't think Mr. Fixit can. can we offer we offer him the quest thingy? I don't think this ridiculous quest item is gonna be of any use to anyone but Strong Sad. Interesting. Homestar, you've been here for hours. Seen any secret levers or anything? Nah, man. It's been pretty chill. Oh, wait. There was this old hooded guy who came in talking about ah, some ancient yes. bloodstone. There was the only way to light up the secret weak spots all over Trogdor's body. I told him we didn't need that old thing. Fantastic! When somebody offers you an ancient dragon-killing relic, you take it! Now where am I gonna find a bloodstone? A great question. Trogdor, look! Defenseless peasant! Let's get it on all the... Oh, 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 I got it, I got it. After you've tasted my blade as the main course, for dessert, how about a little red-flavored fluffy puff translucent dessert-related substance? <laughs> Silly dragon, I'm inflammable! Okay, and then we use the peasants. Got it. That glowing red spot must be one of Trogdor's weak points. Aha! But I'll never be able to reach the rest of the... Okay, got it. Thanks, Marshy. The sentence nobody has ever said ever. Go get him. Take that! Dang, just like right into his freaking neck skull. Beat the arm, beat the arm. Heading to bed. All right, thanks for stopping by. Good night. I think the next one is over here. Yeah. Get him, get him. Eat it, Truggy! Stuck through his hand. Fantastic. Yay, you win! <laughs> oh man, now what? Must have been a load bearing dwag. <laughs> yeah, you know. This video game reality is caving in all around us and fast. 
We better find the fast way out of here. And fast! Steiny, get me a Danish. Finally! Hey, just in time, too. This cave is gonna collapse. Is it a cave? We better get out of here. Me first. Hang on, I gotta save my game. Uh, uh, nail. It's important to always save your game. Rhino, Quick save. Rhino feeder. Ah! Are you okay, Stwog Bad? I just had the most pixelated dream. And you were there. And you were there. And. Uh oh. You were there. What? Oh, I guess we're done. No music, huh? I still don't know what that noise does. What was the point of getting the quest doodle? I wonder if that just like gets you one of the collectibles. There's Redcoat, Ben Franklin, John Hancock, Sam Adams, and Paul Revere. <laughs> Snake Box of Joe. Only does one thing, but he's the best at it. Francis S. Scorpion, Lieutenant Cankersore. Do the other penguins have names? Nope, Performing Bear Space Clown. Algebraic equation. Jell Archie and Professor Pineapple, his totally not made up nemesis. <laughs> Limousine Larry. Hey, Stinko Man. Matt Chapman, Matt Chapman, Matt Chapman. Punchnia Shotsky. Bub, what's going on with your eye there, bud? Okay, you're gone. Bye. Munchox and Robo King of Town. Strong Sad and the Cheat. She didn't do much in this one, did it? He? Him? Trogdor? Trogdor! <laughs> you tell him, Homestar. Miss Moo. Swung by it. Do this. What's going on with the cheat there? That's a choice. All right, all right. Click, click. No, extended play unlocked. Uh huh. Post credit scene. No. I'm in the middle of something to cheat. You do it this time. <laughs> Okay, um, I guess that'll do it for us. I was hoping we'd finish tonight, which we did. I didn't know how much longer we'd have on it. Um, yeah, it was a little anticlimactic, unfortunately. Um, I feel like that episode need needed more Homestar. And more Homsar. Distinct lack of Homsar. Not great. Um, but overall, super, super fun series of games. Uh, I mean, obviously written by the guy who does it, transferred over pretty well. Uh, all the humor and whatnot. Uh, I don't really want to start anything else tonight. Um, unless there's something that we want to jump into. As far as like time fillers. FTL, go back to RimWorld. Uh... Let me look at what else we have. 
Uh, Quit. Let's see. We'll just go back to this one for a moment. I click that. Yep. All right. Um. Like I said, we could just end. 